Hello, this is Ryan Wilcox, and today I'd like to show you how to easily handle Git conflicts in BBEdit using the BBEdit Unix worksheet and the some features of the Git BBEdit package um, available. I'll put the link in the show notes here. Here we are in a Git repository that has some conflicts. Uh, we do git merge, this will conflict, and we get um, a list of files whose conflicts have conflicted with each other. Here right here in the command Unix worksheet, I can just call bbedit and have it open the file. And sure enough, we have a conflicted file. Looks like somebody has a declaration of independence, and then someone has the declaration of independence from Independence Day. Um, one of the new tools of the git package is the git conflict use mine or use theirs. Um, I know from having oh, uh, mine, uh, my version here is at the top. So if we use mine, we will get the Declaration of Independence. And just undo that fast. If we use theirs, we will get the Declaration of Independence from Independence Day. All right, we're going to use mine and save that file. All right, and that's taken care of. We can do just git add that. All right, next conflict. It's another time. Okay, if I use a bbedit tool in the worksheet, and it opens up hello there world. And hello, Ryan. Uh, I like uh, theirs. Save it. Okay, great. Get add this. And another. Uh, you get it? I'll do. Okay. Let's pretend this file has a lot of content so it's hard to see the conflict. Another new tool in the git package is git conflict select start of next conflict, which will select part of the conflict marker. Then we can just simply find the end of the conflict marker and use um, theirs. Save. Get add, and we're done. All right, thank you very much. Ah, get status, actually. Run that. Get status. Get commit. Dash M. We fixed the conflicts. We fixed the conflicts without even having to go outside bbedit, uh, thanks to the Unix worksheet and some clever tools. All right, thank you very much. I hope to. Um, Hope this has proved useful. Goodbye.